Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we've got a upgrade kit from Corsair. Uh, we're going to be upgrading from 8 gig to 32 gigs of RAM. Uh, obviously for video editing purposes, it's going to really help us. Let's dive in guys. This is our Corsair Vengeance RGB Pro. Let's have a look. Um, comes in a neat little box we're going to be just demoing this for us for you guys so let us just unbox it as I've already unboxed the thing previously we're going to slide this out as you can see guys this is looking very very nice Let's have a look at the other side comes with each individual LED light to get this down. Hmm. Very, very gentle. Let's get this down. Is the quality of the build is very very nice very it's an aluminium or some form of copper sprayed in a matte feel to it as these are the spec of these are DDR4 32 megahertz I believe as well these are uh, Aurora the compatibility is with the major boards, Aurora Sync with Gigabyte and MSR Lite. You, we were going to be also installing the software and testing testing these bad boys out. Um, obviously now let's shut down our system and install the memory. With the panel off, now the trick is um, there is our memory module over there. Um, I've got two slots in one, so easy way to just you're just gonna clip. You're gonna put pressure on the down plate. As you can see, you're just gonna put force there. This is my old 8 gig stick. We're going to be upgrading, as I said, to the Vengeance, to the Vengeance RGB Pro. As you can hear, can you get that click? That means that it's fully connected. That's 16 inch. So let's go to 32. Do the same applies over here. Push in, and as you can see here, it clicks. The RAM is now installed. Let's test. As we can see guys, the RGB is fully working. It's really, really nice. We do get a, it's gonna ask you, I'm just gonna say we're gonna run the default settings and continue. We get a Windows. These colors. Absolutely amazing and gorgeous. So 
So the rig is looking pretty sick, two dumb modules. And it's just logging up. And there we have it guys. 32 gigs. Of Vengeance Pro. RGB memory. Vengeance DR4, 32 megahertz. 16 gig times two, 32 gig upgrade kit. Um, I uh, hope you really like this video. Uh, it's Corsair. www.en.icue. This will allow us to download and control our RGB settings. Let's download this now. As you can see, the file is quite large. It's 300 megs. Let's just wait for that to finish and let's install. Hey guys, so the setup is done. Uh, let's the download is done a bit. Let's go run it. As you can see, immediately it picks up the RGB, and what's really cool is you can now add, change the speeds. I want to change it to let's do spiral. Immediately, as I change it, it's now doing spiral, which is pretty cool. I change the precision now to pulse. And as we can see over here, guys, it's now pulsing. It looks like to me, and it's random. These are all the versions you can do. Um, like the rain one looks really cool, but it's really, like, really trippy. Um, this one looks quite nice. This one, you can actually even change, you can slow the speed down drastically. Increase the speed, etc, etc. Um, rainbow. This software is really neat, as it pick, does immediately pick it up. You can set up the dims, you can set up timings if you want. It tells you the latency frequency as well. Um, all the stuff that if you really wanted to overclock etc we could and it tells you graphs the graphing per minute etc what temperatures it's getting to minimum temperature maximum temperature etc and you can even set this for five minutes ten minutes an hour a day etc and you can also get notified you can set up notifications if you really want you can see if the value is that it's going to tell it's going to get triggered etc etc um and obviously this is the profile layout for whatever you need. There's also a dashboard, instant lighting. You can even change the lighting if you want. There are some basic settings. You can change the brightness, etc., etc., how you want. Um, not really that much else. Also, you can change, you can have certain profiles for different games, um, temperatures, etc., etc. You can also set on this. Um, I hope you guys really liked this video. Uh, if you did, give me a thumbs up, like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers guys.